anniversary season, winning the Sixth Man of the Year award. Anthony Mason had won one when in New York, but now he was an arch rival. Former Hornet Larry Johnson was most fired up of all and a critical player in the series. A three-point play for Larry Johnson, a little head rub for everybody, Knicks up seven. Then Patrick Ewing's touchdown to Starks clicked as he went over to Larry Johnson. Knicks by 11, and he's even more excited. Then more Childs, over to a lot more of Johnson. His 17 first-half points led to a most unusual pose. Knicks up 15 and 26. The Hornets didn't give up. Glenn Rice with three of a sort of quiet 23. Vlade Divac with a drive and a slam. And just like that, Jeff Van Gundy and the Knicks were tied at 75 after three. The Knicks cards played well. Starks explosive in the fourth quarter. 19 points off the bench. And Allen Houston was a playoff performer. A three. A three. And another. Three of them in the fourth quarter. He had 25. The Knicks won it. 109. 99. Hopefully, I, you know, we can just continue. Dave Cowens called Larry Johnson's gyrations goofy. Early on, Johnson took it out on D-Box. Later in the second, Knicks on a break. Larry Johnson again, and he lets Dave Cowens know who's goofy. I want nothing for you. The best is yet to come. The best is yet to come. Goofy gonna get goofier. Ah, but this game had a different storyline because Glenn Rice was cooking. Off balance with a foul. From long range. Taking the ball to the basket. Pulling up for a jump shot. He did it all with 39 points. But the Knicks were up five with 3.20 to go. Chris Childs. Heroic. Mixed by seven as Charlotte goes eight and a half minutes without a field goal in the fourth. Two right free throws kept it close though. Then Childs for another big shot. And he strikes the same pose. Mix by five. 20 seconds to go. And Patrick exclamation point to a 30-point game. He shot 15 of 21 as the Knicks go up two games to none. Game three switched to the hive and were the Knicks ready for Muggsy Bogues who drove and hit from the outside getting the crowd involved. And he had big time help from his teammates. Ball movement. A 20 to 12 Charlotte lead. The hive was alive. But the Knicks held their composure and came back. Larry Johnson involved again. Allen Houston continuing to perform. And Charlie Ward with a seminal touchdown pass to John Starks. The Knicks actually led by seven. End of one. Jump to the third. You knew Anthony Mason would be hurt from, even though he played on a toe that would require offseason surgery. Ten of his 14 came in the third, but the Knicks still had the lead. John Starks came the 9-0 fourth quarter run. Knicks up nine. Under three minutes to go. Patrick Ewing. Mixed by six. 45 seconds left. And Larry Johnson ends the series and has a final word for Dave Cowens. The Knicks win it 104-95 and complete the sweep. <laughs>